So you want to know what this brand new Instagram product research method is? Well, let's find out. Okay, so guys, what this method basically is, is it involves you going onto your store's Instagram page. So right now you can see I'm on my store's Instagram profile. And you want to go to the explore page, which is basically this search uh, icon in which is the second one to the left or the right and you want you want to click that and what you want to do is you want to make sure that you're following accounts you know uh, big meme accounts big viral accounts that are posting uh, quite a few ads a day uh, but what really what we want to do is we want to utilize it our explore page and as you can see across the top there's different sections of posts you can see so you can see comics over here style over here tv and movies and you can see different types of uh, sections over here DIY humor and what you want to do is you want to scroll across here until you see one called shopping now shopping is the one uh, for me it's on this the second one with you guys it might be at the very end so what you want to do is you want to find where it's a shopping and you want to click on it now once you click on it you basically see hundreds and hundreds of Google um Instagram shopping ads and shopping ads are you know what I explained uh, before you want to you find hundreds of these shopping ads and you can scroll through your feed uh, looking for uh, potential winning products. So what I would do is I'll click on the first ones, uh, ones that look like products. So some of these are, are like not exactly products, they're just uh, pages who sell products and they tag their products in every single one of their posts. So you don't want to do uh, look at those pages. What you want to do is you want to look at posts like this and see what they're selling. So you click tap to view products and you can see Kazia's Glow Pigment. And you can see the price is five ninety nine pounds. Um, yeah, but that's uh, you know, it's a potentially it's a potential item. You can look into it. You know, you can click their profile, uh, check out their store, click their link in bio, and you can just really go from there looking for some reach research. But the way I would honestly uh, validate products to see if they're selling or not is uh, checking how many followers they have. So they have fifty seven thousand followers for this page, and most of these pages have. Uh, real followers instead of fake followers that some stores buy uh, but they might have fake followers but that's just something if to you know, take on into consideration but because they have 57,000 followers I would say if an ad gets more than 3% engagement so 1 to 2,000 likes on their feed the product must be doing really really well because if more than 3% of the people are liking a specific product on the feed then that product has to have some sort of potential and people must really be liking it so uh, because this one only has 400 likes only 4 comments it's not that much of a, a winning product so I'll just really move on from there so I'm really looking for ones with tons of likes uh, and comments and that shows uh, if they have potential so we can go back off here and let's check here so uh, this is a, a love mode, nothing here, this is nothing there, Boom, -da boom. And we just simply keep on scrolling for, through our feed until we find uh, something that looks good. So look at this. So these are eyelashes. Uh, let's check how many. Okay, the store has 5,700 followers, so not that many. So if they should be getting around 150 uh, likes on this post, but they've got nearly a thousand likes on this post. So that shows potential that these eyelashes uh, might actually be selling quite well. And you know, 34 comments is also quite good over here. So what I would simply do is I'll click this save button over here, and it will automatically be saved onto my uh, save section. And if you want to see uh, see your save section, all you need to do is you want to click your profile, uh, click these three hours on the top right here. And then go to saved. And when you click on saved, you'll be able to see all, all the ads that you've saved in the past. And you can look at products, potential winning products that you can sell later. So I just click save on that one. So you want to go back to the explore page and start looking for some more. Uh, so let's see here. Uh, see so what the product here is. Fix and bodysuit. Okay, so this one has 900 likes. So it's also doing quite good. Shop secret boutique. Um, most of their other posts are getting 100 likes. So, okay, this this one might also be a potential winning product. Now, I'm not a personal fan of selling uh, items like this, so I wouldn't recommend it. But 900 likes is quite a decent amount of engagement. So, uh, you know, that, that's a potential product you want to look at. So you want to click the save button again, and then you want to start uh, look into selling that one as well. So let's just keep on scrolling down. Um, 5,000 likes on this one. 138,000 followers, so um, that's 
So they're getting a decent amount of engagement on the other posts, and this one got 5,000 likes. So it must be something in there. Um, but again, oh, this is not a shopping ad actually. So sometimes shopping ads don't appear, uh, which is kind of strange, even though we're in a shopping feed. Uh, but yeah, let's just keep on going, scrolling through the feed. Boom, boom. Let's click here, let's see what this is. Unicorn Sprinkle Mix. See, anything with a couple thousand likes must be doing uh, good. So, boom, take a feed. I have no idea what that is. Boom, boom. We just keep on scrolling. Let's talk about what's this. They came from the breach. I think this is a canvas. Um, I'm not going to be selling anything like that. We're looking for really trendy, lower cost things that could uh, sell really well on Instagram. Let's scroll down a bit more. And literally in a few minutes, you can find quite a few of these products. Um, ba -da -boom, ba -da -boom. Keep on scrolling down until I see something. Well, what's this? Yeah, that's just some fish line. Boom. I'll let you guys know uh, when I do find a few more winning products, so let's just hold on for a sec. So I've been looking for uh, quite a few minutes now, I've only found two free uh, products. So what I would do is I would actually uh, click the explore button again, go back to shopping, and then swipe up so it refreshes the feed. So basically this will allow more different products to enter the feed, and then I can start looking again. So immediately I see this product here, uh, it's only 17 likes, nothing much. Uh, one here, 1,000 likes and 121 comments, that's quite good. They have 62,000 followers, so yeah, you would expect them to get 2,000 likes on a good product. And looks like this mug is kind of doing good, uh, but it's kind of inappropriate, so I'm not going to spend too long on that. Uh, but just like that, 1,000 likes here, 600. Boom. I wouldn't really recommend a clothing on Instagram, I'm looking for more trendy items, items that we can... Uh, properly dropship uh, without much issues, which is something that you come across issues when it comes to clothing. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. Handbag, nine likes, nothing much here. We see we're all getting we're getting tons of uh, product ideas. They're not exactly a high quality one, um, but. If you keep on going through this, even if you just spend five minutes a day, you can easily find two or three products that you could potentially test out like I have before. Um, but let's just see if there's anything here. Let's see if this is something. I really love my bed. Um, okay, uh, this is just a king ring. 5,000 likes, so there must be something here. All this is more uh, higher end jewelry, you know, making the jewelry look good, and they have 177,000 177, followers. So I wouldn't uh, recommend selling that because they should be getting that amount of likes anyway. Boom, boom, let's see if I find anything else. Okay, so we just found another product. We were going through the shopping ads and we found a page with 630,000 followers. Uh, but it's a page in a different country, so I don't, I can't read exactly what it's saying. But if I click C translation, sorry, we can see that ad got three thousand likes, which means something in it. One hundred seventy five comments, also something mobile support with. So that obviously means um, I don't know whatever this image is showing. So we'll click to save, uh, save it as well. I can come back to it later. But with, so basically, when I click save, I'll just uh, at the end of each session when I'm looking through the uh, explore page, I'll just click on my saved a section over there i check the products that i have saved i go to aliexpress check if they're selling well i use the drop shipping uh center which is a new feature on aliexpress i go to drop shipping center and see if the item is selling more than 50 units a day if it is then it's definitely starting to build up some momentum and then i would potentially look in to testing it so let's see if i find anything else real quick so i found another one with 700 likes here and it's got 172 comments which means it must be doing quite well, you know, for people to be commenting that amount. And the page also has a decent amount of followers, so it kind of should be getting that amount uh, anyway. Uh, but yeah, let's just see if we can find anything else. Boom, boom. Okay, so this one also has 2.5 thousand likes, 177 comments, and this is a uh, one of those uh, bracelets. So that also must be doing quite good, or else no one would be liking that. And we'll see if we can find a few more before we wrap up this video.
Sorry guys, so I had to end that video real quick over there just because my phone ran out of battery. But hopefully you guys did understand the general gist of this new product research method on Instagram. So on the explore page, I don't believe previously you could be able to see uh, different sections uh, for specific posts and especially for shopping ads, you wouldn't specifically be able to filter down uh, ads on Instagram. But now you obviously can. I mean, on Facebook, it is a bit easier just because you can search up for ads and can easily find them, as well as, you know, a few Chrome, exten Chrome extensions like this Turbo Ad Finder, which helps you, you know, uh, boost the amount of uh, products that you can find or ads that you can see on Facebook. But this is basically the best way to quickly spam yourself up with a lot, a lot of ads on Instagram really fast and literally, literally just look at which ones have great engagement, a couple thousand uh, likes and a couple hundred comments and then based off that you can decide which ones you want to go ahead and test. So again there are quite a lot of uh, them out there which have you know general clothing or actual brands selling products so you really want to be looking for the dropshipping ones and they are kind of kind of rare to come around but you should be able to find uh, f quite a few of them quickly. Um, but yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Let's just jump into real post mode and wrap this one up. So guys, I hope you did enjoy that video revealing a brand new product research method we found on Instagram. Really a super easy way that you could find potentially hundreds, tens at least of winning products every single day literally just by scrolling down your feed on specifically uh, targeted ads or shopping ads as I've mentioned, uh, which are directly imported from the Facebook catalog. If you guys do want to set up that uh, shopping ad on your Instagram page, all you really need to do is uh, sync your Facebook catalog uh, with your Shopify store and sync your Instagram account with that Facebook uh, page and you can have access to the Facebook catalog where you can list products up for sale and get that, you know, one click and then link uh, feature, which is, you know, most posts you can't get uh, your post to link to a product unless if you have the catalog synced inside your Instagram account. But you guys, I hope you did enjoy that video, starting off 2019 with a really good video. Whenever you're watching this, I hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop a like down below and make sure to subscribe to my channel because we are going to fill fam again 800 oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. 8,000 subs by the end of the year that's the goal that's the goal we're going to achieve it we're going to get 8,000 subs by the end of the year but I need you guys to make sure you're dropping likes to the, down below you know sharing the video with your friends telling everyone to join the fill fam this is where we provide amazing value practical content to help you guys Get better at Shopify dropshipping, really improve your journey, uh, your chances for success, giving you practical advice, tips that you really need, uh, lessons I've learned, and basically everything related to dropshipping. So make sure you drop a like down below, comment, share with a friend, and yeah, subscribe to the channel because apparently 66% of you who are watching the videos aren't even subscribed to my channel. Like, if you're if you're not joining the Phil fam, and if you, if you have not clicked the notification bell icon, which you have to do. You won't be notified every time I drop another awesome piece of content like this. And but you might even forget about me if you're not subscribed. I mean, do you want to forget about me? I mean, you, you'll get back to me eventually because, you know, I'm just so awesome. I work on this retargeting ad and stuff. Uh, but yeah, guys, make sure you subscribe, notification bell icon, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.